In this video I will show how to configure access rights. We use the project based on the Hello World project. I added an additional device and created a table view named Simulator 2. We logged in as administrator and we can see the both views Simulator and Simulator number 2. We are going to create new users. The first user can access the first view and the second user can access the second view. Now log out and open the project. RapidScanner uses role-based model and access rights are assigned for objects. So we should create different objects. Let's rename the first one and create the second one. Objects can be hierarchical. If we set a parent object, we will not do that for our simple example. Then open the views table and set proper object for our second view, including the Hello World folder. Open the roles table and create two custom roles. Role inheritance usually used in large projects and it, it allows to simplify the configuration of complex roles. The important step is assigning roles to objects. You should specify what access rights you provide, view right and control right. Then create users. Set the password scatter and choose a role. We are ready to upload the project and check how it works. Refresh the web page, give the web application a few seconds to start. We can control if it's ready in the log file. Now it is ready. Login as user number one. He can see only the simulator view and try user number two. User number two access to the simulator two table view. It works well as needed. Thank you.